go ahead make my day Hey guys, hope you are going well. Today I am reviewing the indie drama Captain Fantastic, which I got to see as part of the Sydney Film Festival. So many awesome, awesome movies I got to catch as part of that festival. And this one, of all the strange and bizarre and unusual movies I got to see, I knew that this one would be the more endearing and heartwarming of the bunch. Ben Cash, played by the incredible Viggo Mortensen, is this hippie type father who lives off the grid with his brood of six kids away in the forests of rural Washington. They live in these makeshift tree houses, they farm their own food and produce, they know how to hunt, they know how to fight, they even know who Noam Chomsky is, and for all their feral, wild, like hooligan type ways, they all love each other very much. When they find out that their mother has died, they all pack up in a bus named Steve and head off to the nearest city to attend her funeral. And this becomes the biggest challenge for all of the kids because all they know about the world has all come from books and they've never really experienced it themselves before. This movie really does have the best amounts of happy and sad as Ben, their father, really wants to do what's best for his kids first and foremost. And in his mind, that is living the lifestyle that he and his wife chose for them. And he he is walking this ideological line of a deliberate choice of how to raise them but at the same time the other point of view it's almost like neglect or child abuse not to raise your children knowing about the ways of the world and how the real grounded modern day society works. This moment when the kids are staying with their cousins and they see violent video games for the very first time and there's just a pure look of shock and horror on their face. Ben's father-in-law decides that he wants to file for custody of the children because he doesn't feel like Ben is a fit father and giving the kids the proper education that they deserve and that they have a right to. And we all know that when it comes to family, logic and reason go well out the window and the movie really does flip-flop between Ben's idealistic view of what he wants for his children versus the real world and what they need to fit in. Viggo Mortensen is just my favorite. He does such a wonderful job as their father and his relationship with all the kids and how he treats all of them a very distinct and individual relationships. It is so wonderful to watch. If you told me that a majority of the interactions between him and the kids were improvised, I would totally buy it because that's how raw and just impulsive it all feels. This is a really fun movie that deals with some really difficult subject matter, especially when it comes to death, when it comes to family bonds, and when it comes to just growing up in general, the kids and the adults alike. I really, really enjoyed it and for me, this was an absolute highlight of the Sydney Film Festival overall. They are my thoughts on the very endearing and sweet and emotional journey that is Captain Fantastic. Thank you so much for watching guys. You can leave me comments in the comment section down below. Let me know what you thought of this movie if you got a chance to see it. You can also subscribe to my channel and keep up to date with my other movie and TV reviews and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.